Hello Total War Gamers, my name is Deacon and welcome back to another episode in our Tyrian Mortal Empire's High Elves of Lothan campaign. We've just taken Arnheim and Marathi is coming for us with three armies strong whilst the rest of the High Elves are piling up on all their different settlements trying to conquer each and every one of them. But it's not that easy because there's still uh, no. armies uh, about around and about. And, Why is it uh, our people are suffering from attrition and just to conquer something with the garrison is proving to be quite the challenge. So, um, yeah, we're, we have to stay at it, give it our best efforts and try and go for them. So, in order to find out whether or not we're just doing fine, we'll have to press the end turn and let us see. They're gonna come for us three versus two. We have two full armies. Their armies aren't precisely full, but they have Marathi in there. And she counts, her whole faction counts as stronger than ours right now. Ah, Sabiat wounded their canine assassin. Got a pleasure. Oh, so they're raiding me. Interesting. Oh, and it's costing us 400 per turn even. So yeah, we're going to move out and uh, fight against them. Oops, peace pass. Oop, Bleak Old Fortress is now Tirnok. Bretonia has mobilized, Illyrian has mobilized. And they are here raiding with three stacks too. This is Beastmen, we are not yet at war with them. The Rip of Horn tribe. But uh, these things are doing damage. We have a almost full army here. And a full army here. But it's not something we can attack. But Eltharion has longer range than us. So that's fun. So I'm gonna put uh, Oh, get him out of my camp. As you command. Put him here. Into position. There you go. And now we're gonna take out uh, Atharian and attack them. Wow. We are gonna fight this manually though, because it's the promising Asher to become me. a big battle. They were in raiding stance and it, it doesn't make them all fatigued, but it does take away some of their um, stamina. Two death hags. They're gonna hurt our uh, spearmen. And then three witch elves. They're gonna make us lose control, so that is annoying. But fortunately, we do bring a lot of ranged. And some chariots. They do bring a Reaper Bolt Thrower, however. And we have our Eagle Claw. So, yeah. It's gonna be uh, good to have some more cavalry and flyers and so on. I'm gonna gamble for more magic. Yay! And um, we will have reinforcements, which is cool. But they also get reinforcements, and that's gonna come. It's gonna land right on top of us. So, Northern Seaguard is going to sit here. Regular Archer. archers are going to sit there right behind them. Uh, spares. A couple of them here. A couple of them Spear. there. And Eltharian here. Mage. No, let's put them here. Because there's another army coming from the center. Which Orion will have to catch up to. Let's see what we get. 
let's bring Orion. Orion. Therian, I mean. Is also ending with Ion. Therian and Tal Eagle Tamer the Noble, who has to ride an eagle, but he still has to receive it. Oh, look, nice. Nice, nice. Um, can you pile onto the dark shards with shields? These three. They're gonna try and uh, reach for the center. So we're gonna have to cut them off. And this is gonna switch to... Uh, let's go for big targets. No, for infantry on the... Black Ark says. Now, Tyrion. Where is the second army? And this is my second army. There you go. Put the more chariot. Um, Eltarian Prince, oh, you are on your steed, which is good because. Okay, let's get justifying me as my hair. Start down. Get our uh, Prince into this and these spares as well. This, these spares as well. And. These spares, let them go for this uh, Reaper Bolt Thrower. These guys go for the Black Ark Corsairs. You guys as well. This is more like a clipping action. Uh, we kind of like have to... Where is their, their primary armor? Uh, army? Their first army. Like hidden. Here they are. Tyrion into these witch elves. Tall eagle tamer into the witch elves. Uh, how are we holding up here? These guys are uh, routing, so let's move into the next army. Next unit, I mean. Keep uh, pressing these. That's better, I think. All this ranged stuff. Focus down. The dark shots with shields. These pairs. Uh, maybe withdraw. Ouch. Which elves? Black Ark, Horses, Silver Helms. Thalandor, Doomstar, move this way. Okay. And my main body of archers here. Uh, focus down this Sorceress of Shadow. Dreadlord with crossbow. <coughs> and my bolt thrower. Go for the Dreadlord with crossbow here. Uh, death Hag. Hmm. My prince also go for this Death Hag. Carry it into the dread space there. And my first body of archers and Eagle Claw Ball Thrower start working on these dread spares. 
and I have to get my mage out of here. Press in black our courses with hand bows. Press into them. Where is our prince? Fighting against the sorceress. Chariot into this. Too many death hags. Silver helms into the black arc horses with hand bows. Start working on them. It seems to be going just fine, but still is difficult. Where is that death hag? I'm gonna decrease his mana. Strong versus multiple combatants like Black Ark says. Um, leadership, Bane shield, oh, this is nice, um, no, can we, uh, drop it here and then turn it this way, yeah, whoosh, Boom. Altharian the Prince. Uh, move on the Dreadlord here. Death Hag is, of course, causing mayhem amongst our troops. But we're gonna have to let her instead. We'll focus on these black arc courses with ambos. Them as well. And our Ithilmar chariot. Okay, let's pull out the silver elms. And jump on the black arc courses. Jump on these black arc courses. Jump on these dark shards with shields. So will you. So will you. Oh, we've just lost control over Silver Helm Snow. Spam and get in here. So. Let's do Malcolm's Mystified Nesmar. Since they just hit their uh, murderous prowess. White lines of craze. Get in here. And start working on these dark shots with shields. <coughs> there are way too many spearmen in here. I'm just gonna have to ignore them. Look this way. Our Lord should deal with them. It's the more chariot on the black arc horses. Oh look. Dark riders with shields. Spares on the dark riders with shields. This is Death Hag. Ignore that. It's just gonna damage us. Yep, 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 yep. White lines of grace onto these witch elves. Spares onto this black. Arc horses with hambos. Dark shards. 
and you see if you can reach these whistles. Tyrion is really hurting here. Oh, our silver helms have uh, come back from being out of control. And oh god, mystifying miasma. Twenty-seven still in there. They are quite experienced. I have to give them that. Where is my Ithilmar chariot? Let's go for the Black Ark horses. Altarian the Prince. Go for. Hey, what's this? What is here? Dreadlord. It's all my mage. That's interesting. Okay, no, 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 no. Spearmen on this Dreadlord here. One, two, one. Two, one, two, yep, they are routing off the field now, so I think we're done with them, kind of, sort of, yeah. Lingling, victory, and, and battle. So we are basically here to rank up Tyrion and Eltharion. So that seems to be working out. <coughs> mm -hmm. Faction interfaces, drop down list, summarize useful information for the player about controlled forces, settlements and other known factions. This is really interesting. But yeah, we've beaten them. They're like uh, halfway down, so hopefully we can farm them just a little bit more. Gain some nice victories. The Asher have conquered! And we can it must be done. Kill the, Moving out. the captures, the captives. Armor of Kalador. Cool. We're gonna put that on our noble. Sacred incense. Defender of the Ever Queen. Uh, where are Champion you? Champion of the Ever Queen. Tall Eagle Tamer. Uh, the Armor of Kalador. There you go. Yep. And you're gonna get the Sword of Bloodshed. And you're gonna get the Talisman of Sephri. And you're gonna have... An Itanian Vintner? No. Oh, you can see who has it right now. Uh... Yeah, like that. And... Oh, that's it. Okay. Nothing, nothing else to to do. We have a skill, and since this is tall eagle tamer, he's gonna get an eagle. There you go. For my queen. And uh, now, can we? No. So this Faithful is Altarian. All we Your can do bidding. is just sit here next to each other. Ever loyal. <laughs> Take the. What is it? The the hurt from the attrition. About how about we have rights and there's something we can do to make us immune to attrition. There you go. Ching. That is nice, Prime isn't it? For action. El Parion is our second general. Who is also Speedy Gonzalez now. 
he can mount a sun dragon if we keep ranking him, which eventually we will do. We'll give him some more ammo for his arches. Um, mm -mm. Settlement upgrade available for Ivres, which is wonderful. We will do it. And I think our one turn for our better horses, and then we can recruit cavalry into Eltarion's army. It's going to be awesome. Um, so, is there anyone without war coordination targets? Yes. Tyrannoch. You may approach. Tyrannoch, where is your army? Here. So. Go for Hamel. And Britonia uh, has its target. Onwards! Are at war with the. What is it? The von Karsteins. So All if here I offer you to join your war against von Karstein, will you like to have a defensive alliance with me? Won't happen. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Nordland, how about... Greetings on behalf of the Empire. Trading. We cannot. Kislev? Kislev. They are... Uh, Let us toast like earthly. Slowly, but surely gaining some strength. Fuck sake. Uh, how about you... I have a Let's do that. I don't know if it's going to be fun, but we can try. Meeting stranger. I don't agree. All right. Oh yes, yes Wood Elves. The mighty Deep Wood welcomes. Ryan would also like to have an, an alliance with all the good guys. So, um, how are we doing on our exploration? You Can are on the mission assistance. to go As here. Guides us. And our second lady is on a mission to go what would you have of here. Azir guides us. And that is that. We're ready to hit the end turn. So we're um, peeling away at Marathi's forces. It's quite a formidable opponent, it appears, especially in this phase. <coughs> oh, it might just be that we can actually control uh, Master Mundi now. Because we're defensive allies. And they're also at war with uh, Cult of Pleasure. There's another uh, Lothern or Avalon army coming. Uh, but I want my cavalry trained first. And we should discover Morathi. Oh, here she is. That's funny. So, let's take a look. War coordination targets lost. Let's see who has lost his target. Speak. Let's give. Trace another target. Like a fool's angle. Kind of out of the way. Out of the way for everyone. Uh, Bretonium. We are going to have to deal with the vampires. So, Luon. 
Lay on curve. Uh, mm, 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 mm. Can I spot any vampires? Yes. I can. Here. Castle Temple of. Uh, where is. Oh dear. Uh, Bretonia. Champion of the lady. Four coordination targets. Templehof. There you go. And the Empire Ready. is now back to five settlements. Can go take wood, but. Okay. And yes, we can set a coordination target for Master Mundi. And let's give him something to kill. Like just a, a running arm. And that is that. Now, I think we've done our construction. Dragon armor of Anarian. What does that it means we have to put another line of trace in Tyrion's army. Well, we're just a little bit away from that. Not just a little bit. We're a long way away from that. Your request? First did you go here? Setting sail! Setting sail! You are the sailor lady. I serve the Phoenix King. Good, the Phoenix King is that. It's me, I guess, right? Is that me? That'd be nice. It would be so awesome if that was me, the Phoenix the King. Tyrion Prince of and Altharion. Just go back here. Traveling. Sit in and count. And will then drive recruit back from the Global. Darkness. Silver Helms with shields there you go and an Ithilmar chariot would also be very nice but we can't recruit that yet can we I don't think so let's see what we need to do to get it Dilmar Chariot, no. Yes! So, she should be able to get it. Or he, actually. Um, so, where are we? Merge these two Defender together. Of the Ever Queen. Get... A Dilmar Chariot. Yes. Then he will have a lot more versatility in his armor. But however, he is going to go at the expense of Spamming. I was born. And Tyrion needs another unit of White Lines of Grace. How much would they cost from Global? First we'll put him in a gun. <laughs> then White Lines of Grace from Global takes four turns, really? Alright. Not gonna do that. Sorry, later maybe, but not now. Um, so, the money is all spent. We're going to make... Excuse me. Is that going to cost us 15k? I guess so. <laughs> Gates of Lothern. 13k. I guess we have some saving up to do. Amphitheater. Well, we're not in a hurry or anything. Uh, 
How long will the right Corruption turn? Makes them Lights. I wonder how, how much longer I have this. Uh... Can we focus more? Six more turns, but the right. How much longer does it apply? Because I enabled it, it affects, takes ten turns. But it's, oh, it's, it's here. Nine turns remaining. Wonderful. Okay. So that concludes our episode for now. If you're liking this campaign, leave a like. If you have the the the, the need, the willingness to watch the episode that comes after this subscribe hit the bell button and you'll get a nice notification when the new episode is up so please subscribe and see you next time